feels good to be back out here again, you know, just sharing the gospel of Jesus Christ because, you know, we probably heard about Jesus, every single one of us, or maybe not. You probably heard the name Jesus. You probably don't know what Jesus done for you. Or you probably have where you heard where Jesus died for you. Or Jesus died for your sins. Jesus loves you. But what does that really mean? What does it mean when Jesus died for us? Or what does it mean when Jesus said the truth will set you free? What is truth? You see, there's questions that we can have. Questions that we can ask and we should ask. And confront these type of questions. But sometimes there's one thing that separates us. There's one thing that stops us from asking that question. And it can be fear. It can be anxiety. It can be worries. But at the root of it, it's sin. Now what is sin? Sin is when you break God's law, when you go against God, my friends. And you see, the Bible says that we have all sinned. We have all went against God at some point in our life. Every single one of us, we have sinned against God. And the Bible says that the reward for that sin is death. You see, because God is a holy God. God is someone who just, who is just, who is holy. If you are seeking for justice, you can go to God. But you see, the Bible says that since we have all sinned, we are worthy of death. And that is a scary thought. But the good news is, my friends, that Jesus Christ died for you. That's the good news. Even though we deserve hell, even though we deserve the punishment of sin, the Bible says that the gift of God is found in Jesus Christ. And this gift that God is giving, He is offering it to everyone here today.